per square kilometres. They have a lot of stamina, they work all day. And what they get for that is water all the time, a feed at the end of the day. They come in different colours, black and white, yellow and white, chocolate and white, blue and white, tricolour, also a few whites. They are probably the most trainable dog in the world. Plus they have that other attribute, it's a natural instinct to herd stock together. Today's that working dog demonstration. We send one dog out to get the sheep. And we'll call that dog a paddock dog or a mustering dog. Runs around the paddock, finds all the sheep, brings them down to me. We'll do a little exercise on command. Then I'll put them through that gate up there over that little bridge. And bring them back, put them in the yard. When we put them in the yard, we show you a different dog. It's called a yard dog, shed dog or truck dog. And they keep the sheep up to the shears all day. Our first shearing show today is about one o'clock. So if you want to shear that, see that sheep shorn, come back about one. Some of our trucks in Australia hold a thousand sheep. So we need these dogs to load and unload those trucks. They save the work of two to three people on a property. So they're a very valuable piece of machinery. Plus they're a great mate. Now some of these dogs are worth about three to five thousand dollars each. And a person's wage is about thirty to fifty thousand. So you can see the value of these dogs. Now we're going to send two of these dogs out to get the sheep. And we've got three dogs here today. The one with me up here is Gina. Gina's just 12 months old. She's just a little pup. The other one here is Smokey. Smokey's three years old. Another one over there is DJ. And DJ is three years as well. So we'll send Smokey and DJ out to get these sheep. What do you reckon, Gina? You going to stay here? Come here, Gina. sheep, put them together, and they'll bring them down here to me. And I'll just talk to those dogs through the whistle. They understand most of those whistles most of the time. Now if one of these sheep were to break away, they would disobey my command, just put that sheep back in that little flock. So on the balance point, they'll balance those sheep down here to me. Watching those sheep all the time. We just need those couple of commands on these dogs to go and work in the bush. We got to stop a left and a right, a walk up a keep away, and that'll do. Lay down. Good dog. DJ. 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 No. We'll go and put them through that gate up there, over the bridge, back in the yard.